Hello everyone, we meet again in our lesson. Today, we will study about comparing, order, and pattern. First, we will look at comparing. What is the meaning to compare? Comparing is when you want to decide which one is smaller, which one is greater. So let's have a look at these two numbers. There is 6051 with 4987. Now, which one is greater and which one is smaller? As we can see, the 6051 is greater than the 4987 while the 4987 is smaller than the 6051 now to make it easier to read we use these two symbols this one is for greater than while this one is for smaller than so if we put it like this we say the 4987 is smaller than the 6051 or if we put it like this we say that the 6051 is greater than the 4987 to make it easier to see please look both of them like a mouth this mouth is greedy he wants to eat the biggest one so the mouth always open towards the greater one so no matter where the mouth facing you always know which one is greater and which one is smaller. Okay, let's try. Please do this exercise on your book. Please pause the video and then after you finish it, please continue the video again. Now, let's study about order and pattern. Order is where how many value jumps over from number to numbers okay let's look at this number line as you can see there are some numbers that's not in there hmm what number could be in there well actually there are some pattern between these numbers as you can see the pattern are 10 so, if we try to read it from the left to the right, they add 10 more than the previous number. So, for the first one, the first number that we need to put in there is 1467. Because the order is plus 10, so... 10 more than 1,457 is 1,467. However, if we look it from the right to the left, we will say it 10 less than any number that is in there. Let's see, for example, is the next number that we need to put in. If we look from the 1507, that means 10 less than 1507 is 1497. Do you guys understand? I really hope that you guys understand because it's kind of hard for me to teach this to you in the video. So, I really hope that you understand. If you don't understand, you could just repeat the video again one more time or many times if you want. Or you could ask me 
about the problems that you have. Okay, let's continue then. Now, this is the last exercise that you need to do in this video. I hope you can do it. Please pause the video and then you can continue it after you finish making the exercise. Okay, great job everyone. You've done it. Now, you can post the picture of your work into the Google Drive so I can check it out. After that, please go into the Google form to do your work. And don't worry, I fixed the Google form so it's not gonna be like the previous one. And that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoy your study today. And I will see you again next time. Bye-bye.